Honestly though, this palette is doing something for me. What's up everybody, Alexis Kimberly here. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing this look right here, which is a who knows, I don't know. I don't know where I was going with that, but what is cool is that I'm going to be using the Jackie Ina um, palette from Anastasia Beverly Hills. And this is the first time I'm ever using it. I'm just now opening it and trying it out here. So that's something new. I also just wanted to just kind of sit down with you guys and just kind of do a chatty get ready with me so that you guys can kind of get to know my personality a little bit. And I really just kind of want to know what you guys want to see. Like, leave a comment down below letting me know any video topics that you guys are interested in, whether it's beauty, whether it's more lifestyle. So definitely leave a comment down below with that stuff. All right, let's go. All right, guys, so I have my base on, my foundations on, my powder, and my brows are done. I feel like most of my videos so far have been about hair, which is great, and you guys are responding really well to it. Um, but I think I want to start doing just some more talk through videos as well. Um, and just to like give you guys content where you're actually getting to know who I am. I don't want this channel to just be like completely impersonal. Like I do want you guys to know me and start to kind of like feel out my personalities. I kind of wanted to follow up on my second to last upload, the why I relaxed my hair video. Um, I got so many responses and feedback from that video. I think because a lot of people could relate to it just in the sense that, you know, like as women of color, we get all of this pressure from even sometimes the most personal people in our lives, like our parents or our siblings to like be who they think that we should be. And it's so limiting. It's so distracting when you have all of that other noise going on as you're trying to like figure out who you are. I know that I have felt that in my life, just external pressures, not even really from my family, but just from, you know, just other people having opinions of me and just being in environments where I felt like I was being judged. And that's honestly one of the worst feelings. I guess I should show you guys the palette. This is the um, palette here in all its glory. Um, it has so many different shades and Jackie did a great job in doing a bunch of swatches. So you should definitely check out her channel to see all of the swatches of these colors, but they look absolutely gorgeous and I wanted to support her. Speaking of women of color, hello. Just like another example, like, we should be supporting each other. There's just too many critics of black women generally for us to be sabotaging ourselves. So I was gonna support Jackie on this palette no matter what, um, simply because she is a real pioneer in the YouTube world, in the makeup industry, and she's a woman of color who really stands for a purpose. And I think that that more than anything is what really speaks volumes about her is that she is obviously very successful, but she has a message behind her platform that she always pushes forward in making sure that these makeup brands think about us, people of color, women of color. But I think as women, we have a tendency to purge our own insecurities onto other people. Women love to knock women down. And it's like, that to me shows so much of, so much weakness, really. The fact that you have to then, you know, purge your anger onto somebody else. And this was, is why it's hard to talk and do makeup at the same time, because I'm not telling you guys what I'm using. I just went in with this brown shade right here, Credit. And I put that right in the crease, directly into the crease. And I am just working that, blending that out. So far, the pigment on this palette is really pretty excellent. Next, I'm gonna go in with the shade Pinker, this color right here, and I'm gonna add that to my lid. And then like the other thing that I noticed is like with that, with my last upload, or my second to last upload, the why I relaxed my hair video, like, not that it 
bothers me so much, but like that one got many likes, which is great, but it also got a few more dislikes than like is typical on my videos. And I find that really funny because no, at no point in that video did I ever say like, if you relax your hair, you're terrible. Or if you're a, a natural Nazi, you need to go somewhere. Like I never told any person or any group of people off ever. Like, in fact, I encourage people to go out and be themselves and do them and like really wear that with confidence. And yet that pisses people off when like, <laughs> when you're in a place where you are in total confidence and belief of your belief in yourself other people are like oh my god she's just like who does she think she is it's just like a really offensive to them and i just find that really funny because it's like i'm trying to push positivity i am all about positivity i love when women support each other if i see somebody who is super pretty i always compliment them and i make sure to do it because i know that it has the potential to really change somebody's day. And I just find it funny that like, the people are so pressed, like so pressed to be negative, like get your life girl. So pinker is more pink and pigmented than I expected it to be, but I'm pleasantly surprised by that. Um, I'm gonna warm up the crease a little bit with big wig, which is this color right here. I do kind of wish there were more like just neutral colors in the palette. Not to say that I'm mad, like there's a lot of really nice colors in here. I just kind of like, it's hard when you're trying to go for like something, like a look that's more natural to really, you know, find something that suits you. But I'm gonna just replace what was lost in my transition. But yeah, guys, what, what is it that you guys want to know about me? What is it that you guys are just like curious and seeing on my channel? I definitely love making hair videos. And in fact, in just like putting out more hair videos, I'm just like rediscovering my hair and like re-falling in love with it. So I got to thank you guys for that. Um, but like, what else are you guys looking to see on my channel? Um, what kinds of topics do you want me to cover? Um, so like, leave a, leave a comment down below, letting me know what kinds of topic videos or video topics you want me to do in the future, because I'm looking to obviously put out more content for you guys. So let me know in the comments down below. All right. I'm going to go in with lituation. These names are out of control. Like, <laughs> The lituation, Dwellers, Dwellers, DW, Allers, um, Shookington, Wigglies, like, girl, listen, you, you black, and I appreciate you. All right, so I'm gonna just take my ring finger and I'm gonna just spread that in the middle. Ooh. Oh, oh, we pigmented, like, we pigmented, pigmented. Okay, I'm here for it. I love this. Oh my gosh. And you know what the other thing that's shady? You know what? There are so many shady people right now and I do not like it. I don't appreciate it. But this, even around this palette, there's been so much drama around this palette. And I'm like, this, we can't be serious here. Like, if you notice, there's been so much shade. Like, people are not re doing reviews on this palette. The normal people who you would normally see doing reviews for Anastasia, they, they, they hide in. People need to realize that this world is so big and we are so abundant. There's just endless amount of resource that we are all accessible to. And so there's no need to compete with the next woman because it's just like, it doesn't serve you to be malicious or bitter or resentful of the next person who's successful. All right, I'm a little bit nervous to go in with trust issues, which is this uh, like really white color right here. Um, because in fact, it does produce trust issues because it is not actually white. It is, when you apply it, it's like a really like yellowy shade. Um, so it's very misleading. Um, but we're going to do it anyway, because why not? Oh my God, that's so pretty. 
Hold up. <laughs> We do have trust issues because girl, you is not white. But yeah, I am working on building my Instagram. I have one, I use it, I'm regularly on it, but I don't really post much. Um, and that is absolutely going to change, but I just have not really gotten around to doing that. I want you guys to like send me questions that, you know, if you're curious about certain things about me, like either leave a comment. I mean, ugh, my Instagram is so trash. <laughs> right now, it's so trash, but it will not always be trash. But for right now, it is garbage. But you can always add me on Instagram. Um, it's at Alexis Kimberly, Alexis, the way that it's spelled here, underscore Kimberly. I'll add a little annotation so that you guys can navigate and look for it. Um, you can send me a DM. I am private on Instagram, um, just because of my job, but, um, I am, um, I will accept you. I feel like you know me like in terms of like how I take care of my hair, <laughs> but you don't really know me on a personal level. So definitely, you know, if you are curious about, you know, who I am or like have questions about me, hit me up, hit me up. This year for me has been like one of the most difficult for me. And I guess the reason why I can kind of offer this perspective of just spreading love rather than beefing with the next woman is because I I came from a place where it was, I was very jealous in a lot of ways, very envious of other people's success and I know that I'm not alone in that feeling and to kind of be on the other end of that and just really being happy for the next person has been just freeing for me. Like, let alone, like, you really think when you're spreading this, like, negativity or this negative energy to somebody else that they feel it? They don't. <laughs> they don't. And if they're as confident as they come across, they even if they knew all the negativity that you were spewing at them, it wouldn't phase them. The sun does not rise and fall in their life based off of you. I mean, you are much or far less significant in their life as they are in yours. I'm using MAC Chestnut Lip Pencil right now to line my lips. Um, I'm going to go in with MAC Whirl to fill in my lip. So yeah, guys, that's about it. That's it for this look. Um, gotta lay my edges because these 4C edges are coming through and we gotta get them under control. But we cute. We cute. I mean, but just in terms of content, like there is also another part of my life that is um, kind of career focused, career based. And perhaps some of you have questions about navigating in your own professional realm and have questions about that. The other thing that's new in my life is obviously I am engaged. I'm getting married next year. And so if you guys want to sort of follow me along that journey, that's something that I can consider posting as well. So just let me know what you guys are interested in and I will try to produce more content for you guys that's in alignment with that. But anyway, I don't mean to ramble, so let's just wrap it up. Um, if you like this video, definitely give it a big thumbs up. I appreciate every time I get a like, so um, definitely do that. And um, definitely hit the subscribe button. Hello, hello. We are expanding here. We're doing more kinds of videos. We're doing hair videos. We're doing makeup. We're doing beauty. We're doing career. We're doing self-development. I mean, we're just like doing everything. So definitely subscribe to my channel for more videos. And until next time, guys, I will see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.